everybody! We've been taking some L's in Monster Train lately. Let's try to turn those L's into a W. So what are we looking for? Um, my god. Uh, an Awoken victory would be very nice. Let's go Awoken. And then as our, uh, as our allied clan, I was gonna say our feeder clan, but that's not really fair. Um, let's just random and see how it goes. I, I really don't know what synergizes that well with uh, Awoken. So we're gonna be Awoken, um, Stygian Guard, I think. Good restoration. I love Descend and Ascend, even though I don't probably use them as properly as I could some of the time. And, uh, Space Prism. I mean, come on. Extra capacity? Who doesn't love that? Oh no, the Ally Clan is the Umbra, it's not Stygian. My mistake. Also, my mistake, I'm gonna lower myself slightly further here. When a card with Consume is played, you deal 30 damage to the front enemy unit, or daze enemy units with the Vapor Fuzzle... Fu fuzzle? Funnel. Maybe I'm feeling fuzzled. When they enter the Pyre Room, your Pyre gets minus 5 damage. How many Consume cards do we have? God, this is good. <laughs> it used to be double. Now it's 5 times. It went like 2x, 4x, now it's 5x. We only have 2 Consume cards right now. It is nice, though. I, I mean, making our Pyre able to withstand enemies is also pretty sick, don't get me wrong. I, dude, I, the draw was really good for us. But let's try Rejuvenate this time. And we know this unit is a tank. It just We need to get the healing to make it possible for it to be a tank. And we will turn everything on. Um, and again, I really feel like you can just win. You do your best here when you just accept that your Pyre is going to do some damage. You like looking out the window, Ruka? He's having a good day. Descend the unit and restore 10 health. I mean, you know what I'm thinking. <laughs> In my heart of hearts, you know what I'm thinking. Hear me out here. What have you got? You got the Sentient up here. It's got 25 oh. HP. And then you descend it and restore 10 HP. You destroyed a unit. Now you are taking 20 damage. That's pretty bad. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's not great. Um, you get plus two in lifesteal. Where, where are you going, buddy? This cat, he's been very freaked out. We had some family, some strangers over today. And uh, he's like, he's trying, he wants to be close to me, which is nice. I'm just trying to figure out whether I'd rather you ate a hit or gave me the bonus. I think I definitely... Goodbye, my son. You go off on your own. I would definitely rather you take the hit and leave our, uh, leave our minion, or leave our champion alive. And hopefully we'll draw some restore cards next turn. Really, I don't mind these guys, because, like, the, the pyre is going to destroy them. It's going to wreck them. Well, this is, like, not as much restore as I would have wanted. We're going to stack up this floor. Um... We consumed a card, that's what happened there. Um, so this will keep you better than alive. But I think we will still put a... We do want you at the front, though. You guys are doing 12 damage. One of you will live here. You know, I think that that might be our play. The thing is, we we do want to treat our champion as a as a tank, but there's really no reason, uh, or there's no ability for us to have units that do damage right now. <laughs> our our champion is also our only unit that does like any damage at all. Um, so I think we still like. Well, I don't know how many cards do we have here. We definitely like this. That's a gimme. I think we like the capacity, and that's gonna hurt you, which is nice. And then we will cast this, and we'll get a morsel out there. The Eater gets plus one and a damage shield of one. You're dying no matter what, so I think we will put you in the back. And our other train steward will get will get a little yoked here. Um, well, this doesn't disappear. So for me, I'm like, why not? Even, oh. Oh, because we it was also a heal, and then it did the damage as well. That's beautiful. All right. So right now, I mean, everything's going okay. We did take a little pyre damage, but that's to be expected. Uh... I think we definitely like 
just get in a shade splitter and we'll just put the shade splitter up here for now it'll give us more energy next turn we like the restore on you i think even though you don't need it we get the rejuvenate trigger for next turn and then i don't really want to play this to heal you Do we have another we have another one coming anyway i think we play a train steward at the top in the hopes that we can descend it next turn if we draw a descend and we did we did not draw our big heal though, which which is stinky. Um, so I think he would start with this at the front to tank a hit, and all of a sudden you're killing both of these units now. It's it's a start, <laughs> and we're gonna res we're gonna bring you down. Now you're taking 55 damage. Everything's looking a little bit better, and uh, we'll also cast the restore on you. Now you're taking 90 damage. Okay. Very good stuff. We we don't have any damage dealers, so I'm not really sweating this too much right now. This is like the best I think we could have conceivably done. Now you got 40. You'll die in two hits to the pyre. Um, I don't know if there's much I can do to stop that. <laughs> we get a train steward, and then, uh, you know... Now he's taking 10 damage, so that's pretty cool. And you're doing 4 damage? Okay, maybe this will let you live. No, definitely did not let you live for one more attack. Our Pyre's still gonna kill him in two hits. A totally okay fight for floor 1. Um, did lose some Pyre HP, though. And really, I, I think Restoration Detonation is still what we're looking for. Um... I think, I mean, Space Prism is still really good, but so is Damage Shield. We had it last time. If we get the energy to spend, it can be really nice. But I, I, I do love capacity. Maybe I love it a little too much. So I think no matter what, we want a unit here. So if they give us a choice that has a unit associated with it, we're taking it. And we really need a, a unit that will do damage. And I don't think Vine Mother is it. Every turn it lives, it gives us a spell. And it's an O20. Like, we need something to do damage. But I think we'll try it, and maybe we can get some Sting Synergies. But for now, I really think we have to make a unit uh, do some serious damage. <laughs> I guess it'll be you. <laughs> maybe? I don't know. This feels... This feels not great. Um, I'm like, with spikes, what are we... Are we even... I mean, we do want to use our... Oh, but we can't upgrade our champion like that. I think we reroll, honestly. And then multi-strike is a little bit more... I mean, a multi-strike zero is not doing too much for us. Are we really going to create, like, a train steward that's killer? I think... You may think I'm losing my mind. Um, I think we start cutting these shade splitters out here. Restore is a little bit better for us. I, I I think we start cutting these shade splitters out. And this really is bad. Uh, it doesn't make our deck that much stronger. But we still we don't really have any units that are that are blowing the doors off for us. So we gotta be very careful here. I think at least we're doing a good job of recognizing that our deck sucks. So these guys do get a bonus off in Cant, which is really bad. But we're gonna choose not to do the trial here, just because the trial is likely to lead to us dying. Um, I'm just thinking. I think we definitely want... Well, here's the thing. There's no real reason to put Vine Mother on the bottom. You might as well put Vine Mother on the top. You can always descend them from the top later if you'd like to. Um... Now, I know I said we wanted you at the front. That might still be true, but I legitimately don't know. It's weird. Um, two and five. I think we want you at the back so that you can become a good restoration detonation target in the future for us. And let's, let's see how these things get things done for us. And that, we could use one pretty easily here. Um, and I'll tell ya. I'll tell ya. I think I like this. Oof. 
I like it a lot. Now, I think we sting just to send you. You're not dying. And actually, now that I think about it, I can't really kill you. Um, I think I'm going to let you get away with the gold. I could have done this a little differently to change it, but I think we get the capacity here and wipe... Oh, I thought it would wipe them all out. My mistake. We definitely start here. And then... Okay, so we, we've cleaned it up. We've cleaned it up quite nicely. We do miss out on the gold, which sucks really bad. We have a brief respite. I'd still... Even though I just got rid of this stuff. I still think there's value to the, to the morsels. And if we want capacity, we should put it on this floor. And I think we legitimately just put this train steward at the back. And then stack up... Well, we can't really stack up a second one, but... Okay. So we're not doing much. You must... I was just gonna say, you must have sweep. And you do. This is not great. Full stop. Um... The sweep is really the... It's the hard part. So you're not taking very much damage. We really have to stack up a second floor of train stewards. And I'm slightly skeptical we're gonna even make it through this floor. Because the sweep is just such an unbelievable hard counter to what we have going on. Um, but, but maybe, but maybe it can be done. You definitely want to play Sting. So get that out there. Um, uh, <laughs> sorry, I'm just thinking. We can go Shade Splitter. Oh, sorry, we have another Sting. You get Shade Splitter, who's not even gonna... Or, sorry, you get the Magma Morsel. Because of Sweep, it doesn't really even do anything. Um, and then I guess we Descend, but what? there's no point to Descending you, because you don't do anything. So this is like... It really comes down completely to our Pyre. Like, we'd be Descending that unit just for it to die. I think our... Because it does so little damage, our Pyre should handle it. But, it is annoying. So these are just filling our hands with, with stings. Now I'm realizing the longer you live, the more stings we're likely to draw. Which is great, and also a little dangerous. Because we can, if we draw just stings, we're not really that happy. Okay, so straight up, our pyre is going to take some damage. But it's also, it's going to kill the um, minions first. And then we got you. But that was really bad. I'm really glad we didn't do the trial. Um, this is very clear to me. We need some units as soon as possible. The regen is insanely good. I think a targeted spell with morsel payoff, we can make it happen. But again, we're stuck in a position we really need units. So I think we have to go to this duplicator. I mean, not that we have the money to spend over here anyway. The Pyre Health might be worth something for us, too. So what do we need? I think we need the Quick Animus of Speed. I, I, it's hard for me to believe that that's not the right play. Um, and then in terms of a Duplicate... There's got to be something. But none of our stuff is particularly good. But a, a second Animus... Or, uh, dude, a second descend is kind of interesting, but I'll go with second animus just because we're so starved for units right now. I really think this could be the, the difference maker. Chaos portal. Purge a card, gain a card. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we'll purge a train steward. We just got two better units. And then, do we want Awoken or Umbra? I think we want a woke. Well, <laughs> uh, give me the rare Umbra. It's more fun. 30x damage to the front enemy unit. Barf. I wanted a unit. I was in the pool. At least it consumes. Um, I mean, that's, that's good damage. Don't get me wrong. Constructed explosives have damage shield. Okay. Most important thing. Your Animus of Speed must live. It must live. Full stop. So, I still think Vine Mother on the top floor is how you play this son of a gun. 
You guys don't do very much damage, which is great news. I, I think you just love Vine Mother on the top floor. You got the Sentient up at the front. We can only fit one Animus at the back for now, and that's okay. Nullify the next source of damage. So you would just straight up kill me, which sucks. Um, I'm actually going to save this Animus to hopefully bring it back later, rather than summon it at the top floor where it does nothing, or summon it in the middle floor where it's destined to be killed immediately. <laughs> So the thing is, with a healer, I don't really care if you live, so I'm not going to spend a spell taking care of you. Um, we definitely want more capacity, because that's going to allow us to put our second Animus here. Then, I mean, like, a lot of what I do is just going to wreck you. I'm just going to be straight up with you. It's going to send you into the Shadow Realm, brother. Um, we could also... I don't think we can... Well, we could kill you, but it's going to be weird. Um, oh, this doesn't consume. It's just called consumed. <laughs> I still think you do it like this first. And you're quick, so we don't need to worry about you. Then what do we do here? I mean, Sting doesn't really do anything. Well, that's not true. We could play this. If it gets eaten, you gain an energy. Might as well put it down here. Why not? It's going to get eaten anyway. Then, we could Sting... And forever consume you. It's a bit whack, but we don't take any damage. And again, this the healing unit literally does nothing, so who cares? Um, so we don't have the Animus of Speed yet. But the Ant Umbra Assault is great stuff if I could hit you. But I can't. Oh, but I could hit you... Two morsels. Honestly, y'all are going to the back here. So you can get ready for our next incredible spell. Might as well play our Sting. He just got us a new cut off his new album. Sting! Take it away. I don't think we care about giving you regen. I mean, this is not a great turn for us. Just to be... You know... Train Steward... And then take him down. Look at that. We're, we're going to stack up this bottom floor. You may be skeptical and you may be right. <laughs> but I think we got something going here. Alright. Um, still no Animus. So you get the Wildwood Sap. That's a gimme. You're also dying. You're only taking two. Which means you're taking more than two. But oh, now we can't put the freaking Animus down here. So we got to use these two. So we're getting the Animus down here. Okay, it's very sensible. Then you're dying to quick. That's great news. You're done. You're not really doing anything. A train steward really is just coming out here to die. Um, that, that doesn't mean it's necessarily a bad time to play it. It's just a bad time to play it there. You don't have sweep or anything, huh? I still kind of feel like... I mean, do you put it down there just to die? I think you put it up at the top... And we use our, our Vine Mother as a weird sort of pseudo tank. I guess I, I realize the Sting is not that bad because it does replace itself. If it didn't replace itself, it would be spicy, bo borderline even not good at all. But um, especially as the fight went on. But for now, it's doing like it's doing gangbusters. So do we want a morsel? Yeah. I mean, I think we always like making whenever possible. When we don't have Animus of Speed, we like making our champion tankier. Um, we like to keep that rejuvenation going. We're doing 20 damage, so hitting you doesn't really matter that much. We'll hit you instead. Um, you're already dying in one hit. But nobody else warrants a heal, so I guess we might as well. Oh no, you, you did get killed by that. You did Because it does damage with the spell, not just the rejuvenation effect. Of course, of course. Alright. Alright, now it's getting hot. So we definitely want the Animus down here. You are taking 292 damage. That's real nice, in case you weren't aware. Um, so the Animus comes down here at the very back. Now you're dying. 
So we can pretty much just send it. All right, th this is more encouraging. I hate the sounds. <laughs> it's not the game's fault, but I hate the sounds. I'm just thinking, like, what do we do? More than energy and more than capacity? For now, I almost feel like draw is kind of our play. Spikes deal more. Channel song is really good. We could definitely make channel song work. That That's our gimme here. We don't really have a good morsel build. Um, Multi-strike is kind of... It's kind of interesting, for sure. But you being tankier is kind of interesting, too, huh? Do I have enough tanks? That's, I guess, my question. We have two, right? Vine Mother, kind of, and then our, our champion. But one can block for more than one unit. I think we... <sighs> so you do 27 damage per turn. You die so badly to spikes, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it a try. Now, do we really want draw? We don't need energy yet. We don't have, we don't have enough big creatures. Capacity is always good, but we also... I know I'm blurry. I apologize. We also have the ability to get more capacity. I think this is the rare time we go draw. Hello, Ruka. You feeling okay, buddy? Ruka. Hello. He's so on edge. So, I mean, this is a great path. But I also really... I mean, I hate to do it. This is kind of a low-value path. But our Pyre gets healed a little. And we at least can make one unit pog off to the extreme. This is the gimme. The multi-strike unit now hits... Maybe I got it all wrong. Do you, you hit for 18 times 3, or do you hit for 18 times 3, 3 times? No, that doesn't make any sense. So you, do not do, you did not do 27, you did 9 before. But now you do 54, and you have some HP. And if I do it again, now you're doing 84 with 43 HP. So there's a lot to like there. Now, someone having 25 HP. An Animus of Speed being able to survive an attack. Probably not the worst thing. And then... I really feel like giving our other Animus a damage shield is like giving Carly Rae Jepsen a sword. Who says no? As a tank, it's a little tempting. But I gotta admit, I, I, I love seeing the Roman numeral. I love seeing the Roman numeral there. I think we just made a big play. So what are we worried about? Spikes. No trials with spikes. What do you do? Clipped Guardian, Clipped Guardian. They overload you? I think we can turn this on. I am a little concerned for our Pyre. <laughs> but we can always descend units slowly, because we only have one card in our 24 card deck. But how are you guys doing? You, you all have one HP at the top, right? And you, you probably, I was just going to say, you probably buff each other on death. Um, I'm just, I'm thinking, okay? I'm thinking. You just, he's just studying it. You know how dogs is and all that. So you come up to the front, you're taking six damage. It's not great. However, all of a sudden, these three units are all dying. Look at how it's freaking huge, dude. Um, I mean, I'm gonna be honest. Am I gonna be honest? I'm like, because you're you're tankier, I kind of don't mind. You're not quick, is the unfortunate. But eh, eh, I'm I'm kind of tempted to summon both. But the damage shield is not gonna keep us going for too long, is the problem. But the idea is that we would have another creature up in front soon. So I think the damage shield unit goes down here, and I think because you're tankier, we can afford to summon. It. This is all in the service of protecting the Pyre right now. We do have a lot of restore cards, so there is that. So 
So Vine Mother is our tank that we use right here. That's kind of non-negotiable. Um, we need to keep our champion alive. However, we do also kind of benefit from keeping, well, keeping just about every unit alive, honestly. So let's play. Uh, you really want to move the needle on this one, right? I think if we do this, this at least makes sure we get the gold. Yeah. Um, and we could always play the restore here. Let's start with the channel song, though. So we got a, just a dynamite train steward. Who is going to go up at the front. Now we're getting two kills here. Now, do we play the Weight of Contrition? I think we do, just to keep the pyre steady, but... Now, all of a sudden, I'm feeling a lot more comfortable than I was recently. You are taking some damage, but this is really what Restoration uh, Detonation was built for. We'll still play this thing. You're taking a little damage. You're doing fine. So, yeah, we, we'll... Oh, that's not what it is, though. It's Descent. <laughs> uh, well, I actually kind of feel like the Animus of Will does... Ah, oh, but it's not protected by the tank anymore. But it will still kill the enemies. Hmm. Well, you're quick, right? Yeah, you're quick. You're just doing damage. I really feel like you just... Like, literally... If I could do 20 damage to you, you're done. Uh, so. That's 90, which is too much. But we got time. Can't really fit this train steward anywhere. So we would just, I think, want to, like, restore? How much damage do I need to do to you? 20. I think we're going to double up a restore on you, my friend. Then we're going to ice you. I really thought it would get the- Oh, you don't attack twice! You're just quick. That's- it's still fine. But it's not what I'm looking for, for certain. This is the end for you. Whatever you say, buddy. Whatever you freaking say. So you're dying, which sucks. But now... You're not dying. What a weird world it is. Um... We need to... Any floor is fine to give space for a train steward. Really, the top floor is probably where it matters the most. It also kills a unit, which is nice. But it, it is a weak unit, I'll admit. We gotta get this out there. Um, I must admit, it's, it's very tempting. Hold on, we can also do this. I think it's well worth it. Do we want a restoration detonate you? 12 times 5? It'll definitely kill you. I I want the slay trigger, and I want the consumes. Uh, or I want the regen, I should say, but I also want to make sure our pyre stays safe, because it's been a little hot. <laughs> uh, unfortunately. Uh, so you're doing great. You're doing great. Keep it up. How about one of these? How about one of these? Um, restoration detonation. I mean, we got three of them. I think we definitely... Use two of them. Because we're going to draw more, probably. So who do we want to get stronger? A unit with the most HP. Or multi-strike, but we're not going to get a multi-strike. So you have 26 to 20. So we actually want you to get strongest. And if it doesn't matter, that's great, because it means you already won. Then you're definitely healing. And we want you just to heal. We don't care so much about the, the rejuvenate trigger. We just want you to heal. Okay, floor one, you're taking 50. We know the stings are coming out, unless you get encanted. Um, I don't see a real negative to bringing down the Animus of Speed unless you sweep, which you don't. Um, so I think you bring down the Animus of Speed. Now you're taking 175. We can still hit you for 30. I'm just thinking about whether or not this consume moves the needle. I think it definitely doesn't. So we could rejuvenate you, but it's not really necessary just yet. We could play a train steward on floor two. 
I don't think that's great either. I think we'd rather just hit you for 30. Man, oh man. I would love to kill the units at the back here. It's decent damage, but we gotta we gotta get those back units destroyed. Ah! Um <laughs> What? Okay. So that's a big one. Uh could we also like we just want a train steward in front of you? Block as much as possible. And then, like, you're this is the first time I've really taken this much damage off of the freaking cards. Not to mention they stick around. This floor is meaningless to us. Um, this is the big one. You are being killed, which is fantastic news. You can also play these. Alright, that was way closer than I thought it would be. But this was with the trial on, so we're getting uh, we're getting something special there. And it wasn't that close because at least we... Like, our top floor was basically untouched. If I had a good Sting Synergy, I would be stoked, don't get me wrong. But I think we're actually big on more heal right now. Deal 20 damage to a random enemy unit four times. And kill an enemy. You get two. I think we gotta skip this, unfortunately. We just don't have, uh, we don't have enough... built-in synergy with anything to really make it justifiable. It does feel to me like we should make our spells better now. Like, our units are fairly gemmed up. But our spells are like... They don't have much going on right now. So I think that's our, our play. We also get to heal the Pyre, which is nice. It's, a, it's an iffy run right now, though. Upgrade a spell to remove consume, but it costs more. <laughs> you're, you're gonna say Channel Song, and it is really good if it hits multiple units. But we can't wait to play units in a lot of situations. But it is good. <laughs> Especially on like a multi-strike. Yeah, fair enough. So we'll make it cost less. Yes, thank you. Um, but it is going to become a dead card eventually. But it's going to, I think, do some good work before it becomes a dead card. Um, the restoration detonation gets a lot better. Yeah? Yeah, I think that's probably your play. And then... I think you go for the reroll ahead of the purge. Permafrost I don't really like. You can make something better, but also give it consume. Man, I wish that was like more multiplicative. I think actually restore... consuming itself is pretty okay. And then let's make our descend cheaper. And okay, I don't I don't know how much that's gonna move things for us, but it, oh, we didn't go to the concealed caverns. What was I thinking? The historian. Okay, am I honest, aggressive, or stealthy? Gain thirty gold. No. <laughs> we just really like petty theft, right? If it, it does two damage, but you get fifty. Every time it works. Oh, it's 30x, though. So if you play it, you could get a lot of gold out of that. I see it now. There's some temptation for the one that gives our pyre more damage. I would ideally like enemies to not make it to the pyre in the first place. Ruka, don't, don't be freaked out, buddy. It's just it's a nice day. Enemies enter with spell shield. Really? I just think we can't turn it on. Stealth 8 is also horrible. I think we I think we gotta stay as safe as possible here. This is where a lot of runs die just before the second boss. Okay. I'm just thinking it through. Just thinking it through. Surely Sentient does a lot of good work for us on floor one. And then this is quick and damage shield animus. I still think like Vine Mother on the top floor is a good play.
I think this works as well because of how many consumes we've got or how many uh, regens we've got in our deck. I think you like this on this floor. It does the damage, but it also makes space for two more units. And then honestly, I think you just like... I mean, this is a tanky unit, so we put a strong unit behind it. If only we had some kind of encamp trigger. But... Okay, you being behind there is really nasty, but... Um... These are hard turns to think of right now. It is fairly tempting to put the multi-strike animus down here as well. But, <laughs> if I move it up a floor, we do get the gold. So you know what? But you're, well, hold on. Oh, you got so much, you're, you're gonna be fine. But now that I'm thinking about it, I'm like, dude, we want something for Channel Song to hit as well. So I think maybe you play like, I'm thinking, okay? Um, you definitely play this no matter what. I think maybe... You play one Animus up here, not the Multi-Strike one, because the Multi-Strike one benefits a lot more from Channel Song. And then you just... We're kind of stalling for Channel Song, and it's gonna look really bad for a bit. But it could get really nice after this. So we did get Channel Song. You gotta start there, I think. So you're quick. But you, okay, this unit will live, though. So let's start with the Channel Song. And it got a Train Steward. But that Train Steward is now Dynamite. We're like, we're so happy to see them. It'll make your head spin. And I think we could actually... We could move them up a floor to block for this. Sting is definitely coming out. We'll make sure we get you, then you're gonna get got too. Okay. Our other train steward, we super do not play. If we slay a unit, get plus 50 gold. It's a great time to get that out, although you do get the armor trigger. Um, we, can st we can hit you for 40 and then an extra 30 after. Or 30, 35, apparently. Um, I, I think we're doing this right. And I think it's it's required more thought than I'm used to. <laughs> Which is maybe why it was so so tough for me to wrap my head around it. Um, you got space for two. You've only got... Okay, so you are going to get this, but hold on, hold on. We slay a unit, we get 50 gold. Oh my word. It's pogging, dude. Um, I still think... You know what? I think we can make this happen. You're getting killed. It is tempting to move a unit down. We're definitely not going to move uh, Vine Mother down. Take 50. So you're all, you're exactly dead. So we definitely want to play this down here. Restoration Detonation doesn't do much for us. It would do 10 damage. We'd rather have the regen, I think. However, it's really a question of whether or not we want to descend. We could just play this for healing as well. I think the answer is we do not want to descend, but it's close. I just don't want this guy to get away, is the thing. So we definitely, I think we just start there. Um, and I think no matter what, you just do it. You, you do 35 or 30, what, you do 30, 30. Okay, so we, brief respite, we're hoping for channel song. We didn't get it. Uh, and that's okay, you're quick, so every, everything's fine here. There's only, there's only two units available for Channel Song. One would be... Because the boss is coming out, I think you have to play your Animus. So that it's for sure out there when it, when it counts. You're gonna die to nothing. Um, just keep playing these so we get the draw trigger for next turn. Don't play this, though, because Channel Song will hit it. And we're guaranteed to draw it next turn. Yeah, but we, we probably could have left it. We could We could have left it. No probably about it. We'll just get as many regen triggers on you as possible. I think we're still gonna be fine, but it does- the boss has stealth, right? So they get one free turn to be annoying. Stealth eight. Oh, eight free turns. Okay, but you are taking- it's actually good, believe it or not. Or it looks okay. The fact that you're taking 300 damage is totally fine. Um, or is actually almost nice. That being said, we would rather ascend a unit than descend. But you don't sweep. 
No, you don't sweep. Knowing that we're guaranteed to do damage, I think we actually do like channel song. We know the train sewer is going to pop. That's not a, a question. We lower our unit. Now you're almost dying. Um, and we're definitely going to play the sting no matter what. And okay, get train. The other train steward up here is going to make a nice wall for you. And uh, I think just more restoration. It did it. It did it. <laughs> All righty. Yo, that's good stuff. Our animuses are getting it done. Just barely. But we had a decent floor on top of that. And we didn't even really wait for Channel Song. So I, I'm pretty stoked about that. Uh, I really don't think any of this is that essential for us. Rooted can be nice, I'll admit. But Applied Damage Shield. Oh, we just can't afford it yet. Um, I do think Grovel can be good enough. The Damage Shield letting a unit live to attack one extra turn. It's worth, it's worth it, I think. So yes, I do think... Um, oh, I mean, it's... Come on, there's a temptation. Uh, but... I think we like this path. Regen restoring more health is pretty good. Two damage to enemies when they move through floors. It's nice to kill the support units at the back. I, I, I mean, that's like... It's really nice. Um, but regen allows us to really stay in there on those boss fights, I think. So for removal, I think you just go straight up for the two train stewards. We don't want Channel Song to have less to hit. But you know, it's actually okay because we'll use a Hellvent to duplicate. Um, I think our, our super multi-strike unit is definitely where you go. And if you if this thing gets hit by Channel Song, it's all over. We could stall for it to try to make it happen. Okay, so you have multi-strike and also rage. It's bad. We'd rather fight you as far as close to the top as possible. And we gotta kill all three floors on this one, so it's a little it's slightly dicey for sure. <clears throat> no channel song. It hurts. This is to kill the marksman is very nice. I think we just like the sentient at the front. And then you know what? I, I mean, you're doing five. Put you two back here. Buff the sentient a little bit. We want more capacity on this floor. We don't need to play you yet. We can wait on you. Might seem a little funky, but we can wait on you. And then really, we want Vine Mother just to exist. And we're gonna stall on that Animus. I think it's the right play so we can hit it with Channel Song. But I'll admit, there's some spice involved. Now. We do get Channel Song. That's pretty much our number one play. It has to come out there. We hit a great unit. It's now a 45-23 with quick and two damage shields. I still think we play with the back. Because that damage shield is not going to last forever. we go hard on the consume make this bottom floor just a, a nightmare for enemies to get through um, taking five it's hot but I think we got to slow you down so this is this is how we start slowing you down now channel song doesn't exhaust the question is can we wait because <laughs> these are our only two units and we for sure for sure want the multi-strike unit to get this. Um, I gotta be honest, a quick unit doesn't really matter that much right now. Do we really stall? It'll probably kill you one turn faster. Do we have more capacity coming? Okay. I've, I've got a game plan. Oh, but I, I'd have to descend you. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Hear me out. You go here. I'm getting ready to descend you later. Channel Song can now only hit our multi-strike unit, I think. 
It's a big if, but... And then we have to use this here, so we have space for all the units that we're trying to move down. Um, I just want to be... Yeah, we don't have any other train stewards. Okay, so you're going to make it to the next floor. You're going to get hit four times. It's pretty bad. We do need to do something on this floor now that I think about it. Um, you definitely start with this. And that's good eats. You're not that hurt. That doesn't mean you wouldn't benefit. Now you're dying, which is great. Um, I don't know. What, what do you sting then? You die before you even get to attack. This doesn't move the needle for us at all. I mean, you still want a sting. Okay, I mean, I think we just sting you so we get something out of it. And then I honestly think we get a morsel of some sort just to make, you know, a unit better. I should have given our, our Vine Mother a damage shield. For some reason, the thought didn't even cross my mind. Um, no channel song. It's very bad. Petty Thief is what we want to see here, though. Um, and this is kind of what we wanted to play, too. But you're going to make it. You're going to do 10. I mean, I don't care if our Pyre lives with 1 HP. Dunk, 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 da, dunk, 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 So, I mean, this is what we wanted, really, was to descend you. So, why not? Although, we could, <laughs> like, we could descend, descend you. I actually think that's our play. <laughs> it's so stupid. Immobile! How dare you! Alright, Pyre, just hang in there, brother. You're gonna you're gonna get this done. It's channel song! Oh my god. Okay. Now you go here. And the point is now nothing should be able to make it out of the bottom floor. And I know you're thinking, how the heck are you gonna kill this guy on the top floor? We have a spell that can do some real damage. We don't have it in our hand right now. You know what's freaking me out? Why would we play this Animus of Will when we could get it out again? You know what I mean? Mm, that's not as good as I thought it was. Like if Channel Song can hit it one more time and then we could descend it. We could just... You're, you're dead. Why am I concerning myself with... Oh, we still have the Train Steward as well. Uh, okay, 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 okay. It's simple. You play the Train Steward. I do still think you play it at the... No, that's stupid. You play it at the front. But then you're dead! <laughs> that's good, because it's gone from our deck, maybe. Okay. Now, we still play this. And you still get toasted, but... Okay. Okay. I've got plays. They're, they're a little wonky, but... There's something here. We wanted Channel Song. We didn't get it yet. You're taking 17 damage. It's nothing. It's nothing. If we can sting you twice, that would be worth something. You're at full HP. Hate to see that. We do want to descend you. Because you're the... Aren't you super? No, you're not super yet. Still pretty good, though. Still pretty good. You're not going to have sweep when you come out, are you? That would, that would be really bad. Let's send you down here. Let, let's continue creating our nightmare floor. I don't know what you play. I think you play these two. Even though they don't do that much, I think you play these two. And our pyre is just, it's a victim of circumstance. Oh, but we're doing some real damage to the, uh, to, to the boss. Okay. Please, God, give me the spell I need. I don't believe we got it. They're gonna, oh, they did give it to us. Okay, so we need to do 90 damage. Full stop. Get out of there. You're already toasted. All right, are we ready to fight now? Can we can we fight? 
final wave. So we got Channel Song, which is exactly what we're looking for. We can't lower, which is unfortunate. Are we dead? Oh, you're dead anyway. What do I care? So somehow this worked. So what are you doing? Just, you know, you might as well play this, but then send it. Okay. Um, so we beat the second boss. It's a bit of a wonky deck, but it's, it's definitely getting the job done. I'll tell you, I'm really glad I took these multi-strike animus and like quick animus. It's doing a lot of good for us. Also, I'm gonna tell you, I got nine plus Discord messages. What the heck even went on here? Good lord. Oh, it's Team Unity stuff. All right. Collect. I'm ready. I definitely think we could make Cycle of Life work. Although, does it decay? The spikes decay? They don't decay, right? Enhance you with plus 10 HP. Maybe we want nothing. We don't have super weak units. Our, our front, like our champion is what we would want to use this on. Or maybe we could use it on the Vine Mother as well. I think we are going to take energy this time. So I, I think we can find a place for that. We will take energy. Capacity has not really been a problem, I think. Now, we have so much money. It's upgrading spells or units. No duplicate portal. Remove is always nice. But I think I think we're due for spells. I think our units are mostly... I would always love them to get better, but a lot of them are full already. It's not like our Vine Mother is going to pop off anytime soon. Ah, but we could make our other animuses a little better. I actually think this is the way to go. So let, let me work on this one for a bit. <laughs> Obviously, Endless is really good. Really for, like, a unit with some damage shield. You, and actually, that would give us a good way to get Channel Song working again. <laughs> but Multi-Strike is so good. I think we, I think we got to reroll right out the gate. <laughs> Quick. Sadly, not that good. We can't reroll again, though. I mean, are we going to make a, a quick and buff train steward? <laughs> no. In fact, what we're going to do is call a train steward. Um, so we can make Vine Mother quick. I really want you to have multi-strike. This is like, you know, for, for 20, sure, I'll spend on that. Um, and I'll, I'll give you spikes four. But I actually think we save the rest of our gold. Maybe we look at this and we go, you know what, cut like a basic restore. I think I could justify that. But I think we save our money for the next shop just because quick doesn't do it for us. It doesn't, it doesn't do enough. Um, let's upgrade our champion. We definitely just want to keep the rejuvenation going as strong as possible. And then for unstable vortex, we can cut our other not so good restore. I'm going to be honest, I think Shade Splitter for the most part has been pretty bad. We might be cutting too much, but I think that's a quality problem to have. Cutting too much as instead of keeping a lot of garbage. Non-boss enemy units recover all HP when they go up a floor. I don't really think we can do it even for 400 coins. I'd like to. I'd like to, I'd like to take the terms of your deal, sir. But I'm afraid that it's not possible because it's insulting. So you have Ember Drain. Ember Drain is real nasty. I will tell you, without getting Channel Song, for me, I'm like, you definitely do play Vine Mother. I think you still play her on the top. Um, I think you play Sentient. And if you get hit, whatever. Because you just exist to get hit. Um, get one of those out there. But I don't think we play these. I think, well, <laughs> I don't know. Having two of them is pretty nice. I think you save it for Channel Song. I really, genuinely think you save it for Channel Song. We're going to have lower mana next turn, unfortunately, because of the Ember Drain. But I, I believe in the power of Channel Song. 
This is another not great turn for us. Um, let me just tell you, man, oh man. I would love to get Channel Song going a little faster. If I could play this for one, you'll be in a good spot. Okay, okay. Well, we did this wrong. We could have we could have killed you. I guess we still could, but it would cost us a unit. And you're kind of like, honestly, at this point, you're the weakest unit. I don't mind you getting out here. And then for one, we're really just going to get a restore trigger here. And then we're going to ice you. And then we're going to get the gold. Okay, we, we got something going. It's good. We're, we're going to be a bit of a slow builder now. But as soon as Channel Song comes out, it's going to start to do incredible work for us. Okay, so our multi-strike unit is now disgusting. And you're just going to fit back there. You're not both dying, though. You have 115. We would need to hit you a little bit more. A, a restoration detonation should do it. You're not dying, but you're close. Now you're dying. Okay, and we need more space at the bottom, so that's a gimme. Um, you're not dying now. Why is that? Because I haven't played that card yet. Now. I think we'd like to give you the morsels. And we will just give you the regen that I know you so strongly desire. And keep in mind, Channel Song's whipping around. It's whipping around. We didn't draw it again, but it's whipping around. So now, 100%. I do think you play the Descend to make this floor even worse for these enemies. And then I think you keep whipping this around. And there's not, no reason not to send these. Petty Theft, unfortunately, is not quite going to get the kill for us, but... You're not both dying, which is incredible to me. As of right now, we do have no mana for the next turn, though, which is not ideal. <laughs> we don't have Channel Song again. Hold on. So you're dying. You're taking 108. You have 105. Definitely, like, too lazy to do the math. Yeah, that'll work. <laughs> Sorry, we got no mana next turn, but it's okay. Well, we got one mana, but it's a brief respite. So, we'll channel song. Oh, baby. It's not really what I'm looking for. I want that multi-strike unit, but it's okay. And then, I mean, I feel like you can just play the stings just to get the draw next turn. Can I pull you down? No, no. Well, you're dead anyway, so what do we care? Yeah, I mean, fair enough. I mean, we're not. Re There's no real reason to play this stuff, I guess. But you know what? Maybe we could have made this work on the uh, on the uh, the trial. But hey, who needs another 400 gold anyway? <laughs> we're actually doing okay on gold. We could we could probably buy out the shop. Ooh, huh, ooh. You know what we would like? Channel Song getting holdover, even though it would eventually be useless, would be amazing to make it move a little faster. And I, I definitely think the double descend can totally work. I think cave in could work. Now, adding two cards to my deck this late is a little bit spicy. We'd like to take a spell upgrade path, which also has a duplicate, so that ends 75 coins. So we want a holdover. I think immediately you can spend 50 on a reroll without even sweating. No holdover. Remove consume and it becomes more expensive. I mean, more capacity is always nice, but we're going to outscale one capacity card so fast that the sap is kind of your gimme there. We should have bought the other stuff first, honestly, as well. Um, and then a spell getting extra magical power. Definitely we like it on Focus Growth, even though we haven't played it that much. And we're not really doing anything else with our gold, unfortunately. Oh, we, we totally are, because we get us, uh, some trinkets. Sting spells get plus 20 magical power. Um, finally. <laughs> the reason 
I have held uh, this the whole time. And I, I really do think we double, though it's bizarre, I think we double Channel Song. It's gonna be a dead card, but it's gonna be so alive before it becomes dead. And you take friendly units enter with Sap 3. It's not that bad. Because we don't rely on low damage multiple times, right? So Sap 3, it's like inverted rage. It's gonna make our multi-strike units a lot worse. But not that bad. So we definitely play a channel song. It hit the exact unit we wanted to hit. We put you up at the front. You're sapped. You don't get to attack, so I don't think you're ever gonna get over that. You're still doing a lot of damage. <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. And I think we just let you get away. I'm not worried about you. Yeah, we, do, we don't play anything else because Channel Song hitting it is worth so much. Now you're both dying. Let's draw two next turn. Oof, oof, oof. We got another Channel Song. Pretty much has to be played. So start there. Oh my god. Oh my god. Um, start with Channel Song. We can play and descend you. He's gonna make this floor real nice. We definitely want more... I, we're, we're gonna outscale the capacity, but honestly, the AoE is pretty nice. <laughs> I hate to say it, but it's but it's honestly true. Um, and we definitely want a restoration detonation. And now you're all dying. You're still taking 50, which is horrible. There's not much I can do about that 50 right now. Um, so honestly, I think we just put a Vine Mother to protect our Pyre from 10 damage, which could be relevant. And our Sting cards, that's right, I forgot. Our Sting cards are just absolutely incredible now. Um... That hurts. We need a lot of heals. Well, okay, hold on. We got big plays. Start with the... The regen. Are you living? No. You're taking 50 damage. That's like, kind of a lot. A damage shield won't protect you. That will protect you, though. Now I'm like, for you, we could descend you and restore the HP and then our Pyre will take a slight hit. And I actually think it's like... I think that's the play. Because our Sting spells are so much better now. That, that I think we definitely want them every turn. Okay, so Channel Song is what we're looking for again. Did not get it. We want... Bizarrely, we want more capacity and more capacity. Uh, restoration detonation is the perfect amount of damage to get lethal, which is hilarious. Uh, you're doing fine, more or less. You do have seven turns of sap. It is nice to give you plus 10 HP, I'll admit, but I kind of feel like keeping our Vine Mother in a good spot is also very advantageous. So let's heal you up. Let's make our Vine Mother a little stronger. Yeah, I know, we're sad. Everybody's getting sapped, okay? Welcome to the freaking show. Um, and we'll just, you know, do a little damage to you for no reason, I suppose. The hard part right now is keeping our champion alive. Case in point. Um, we, have, we do have Descent. Okay, so you need to play Channel Song. I'm telling you, this... <laughs> you get a multi-strike unit up here. You Descend them. Now. We got another Channel Song. There's nothing to hit, though. Alright, so I mean, we're gonna play our Restore on you. That is enough to keep us alive, which is awesome. 
Um, oh, Channel Song can't hit this because it's in our hand, so we might as well save Channel Song for the future. All of a sudden, we're still taking 30. That's pretty bad. But the restores are still going. Oh, now we're doing something. Okay. Again, we need to keep you alive. Do we have a better res restoration detonation? We don't. But, hear me out. You're not doing anything. Okay. So we like this. You're not living. We like this. You're living. But you could live better. Um, I think we... Problem is, can't get anything else out of this. Regen 5, I guess. Oh, but it does so much damage at the front end. Ah, you gotta do it this way. Now we're taking four damage. It's a really good sign. It's a really good sign that we're gonna we're gonna pull this one together. I think we really just destroy you. Channel Song doesn't have a target because the, the card is in our hand, unfortunately. What do you have? Slay. Unlikely to matter, I would say. Honestly, I think you just... Just keep it rolling. You know, make make your champion that much tankier. Final wave. They're not dying, but they are taking 1,800 damage. So we want the big restoration detonation. And we got it. Now you're dead. This, this is unexpected to me, but very interesting. <laughs> you're doing one damage? Welcome to the freaking party. I can't believe it, dude. It was so easy. Now this is going to take a bit. We do have some high damage enemies, but it's still going to take a minute. Well, from, from what appeared to be a little bit of a spicy run at the start, we've managed to put together something pretty special. An awoken victory with a little Umbra sauce on the side. We didn't really use the Umbra for anything now that I think about it. <laughs> Not really at all. In fact, I think we removed almost every Umbra card from our deck. But look at that. And the Vine Mother did it, dude! That's so good. Alright, I mean, that's an impressive victory, this Covenant Rank 3 hand. We finally, we, we broke our little two-loss streak. Come on, don't be, a, don't be a coward, show me my score. 33,000, Covenant Rank up, minor bosses have increased attack. Ooh, some goldies. Awoken leveled up. Sweep, and you get stronger. I like it. Consume, draw one, enhance the drawn card to cost zero. Also very interesting. Then for the Umbra, inert multi-strike. It needs fuel. It needs to gorge to get fuel. That's funny. Okay, it does just, you know, get extra energy. And look at that. Sorry, Cobalt. I got you by 3,000. I beat you 3,000. Ooh, it's so nice. Eh, don't get... Well, for now... Hope you guys have enjoyed the episode. If you did, uh, click the like button. It helps out a great deal. And, of course, subscribe. Congrats, Simpic. Congrats. Subscribe if you want to see more in the future. Um, click the like button. If you watched all one hour, eight minutes, and 41 seconds, I'm going to assume you enjoyed the video. If you did, click the like button. It helps out a great deal. And, of course, it's the best way to send a message to YouTube. The message that you send to YouTube is, uh, hey, show this guy's content to more people. It's good stuff. I would love it if you clicked the button. Apart from that, subscribe if you want to see more. Comment, of course, and I'll be soaking up dopamine there. And I'll see you next time. Tomorrow. See ya!